You've got 67 gas field free communities here in Victoria. They join up with the over 300 gas field free or mining free communities around this country. 3 million hectares in New South Wales alone. That is monumental. And why? How do we get to that point? Because remember that not only five years ago, five years ago, mining was untouchable. These communities said no to all forms of onshore gas drilling. We, the people of Victoria, unite to declare our state gas field free. We come from all regions, walks of life and political persuasions. We uphold our right to protect our food, air, water, heritage, the land and our livelihoods. We promise to defend the entirety of our state from all forms of unconventional gas until Victoria is declared unconditionally gas field free. My name's Trevor Sweet and I'm from Sea Stray. far removed from the will of the people and the law of the land in a greedy pursuit for profit that they have lost all common sense. The will of the people is that fracking and unconventional gas is just not acceptable and is just not worth the risk. And the law of the land the law of the land says you can't spoil good water. The old world is rapidly aging, said Bob Dylan, and a new age is being born. Well, a 
up to 1,000 farmers and country residents have united in the city to protest against Victorian gas field exploration. With a government review into gas mining due by the end of the year, farmers say they want the public to know what damage it will cause. For those affected, the message to miners and the government is clear. Lock the gate. No fracking way. Farmers travelled from all parts of the state to have their say. This has been a long fight and I've been waiting for today for a long time. So bring it on. Trevor is a fifth generation cattle farmer from Sea Spray, where 14 exploration gas wells have already been dug. If we haven't got a good clean environment, clean livestock, Without that, there will be no people and there will be no economy. Irene and her daughter travelled four and a half hours from Portland to join the rally. The thought of gas wells surrounding my property is horrifying. I've lost sleep over it. Coal seam gas drilling and fracking is currently suspended in Victoria while a parliamentary inquiry is conducted into its safety. This is a genuine review. Let's see what the work comes back with. It's not a matter of preempting that. 67 Victorian communities have already declared themselves gas field free. Each town represented on these yellow placards with the percentage of locals who have voted no. Be under no illusions, in New South Wales we have fought this industry to a standstill and we will do the same in Victoria. If the review votes to allow gas fields in Victoria, the Premier may have a rural revolt on his hands. The Labor Party, they keep crowing that they are the party for the people. Well, we're the people. We're the people of Victoria. We need to stand up and fight this industry. No